is believed that the virus known as pneumonia originated from Greece. People known as hypocrites first noted this during 450 BC to 370 BC. He called pneumonia an illness named by the ancient. According to Anne Baker, a reporter for the ABC website, pneumonia is the main cause of death for most of the children in the Northern Territory, Australia. Pneumonia is very popular in Northern Africa, where there is little to no treatment. So there is a lot of death in the area of the world. Pneumonia is also common in parts of the world, such as South America and Saudi Arabia. The treatment for pneumonia will depend on what is causing it and how severe it is. Antibiotics are commonly used for bacterial pneumonia. If your pneumonia is severe, you may be given antibiotics that is infused into your vein. If it's given to you by a virus, the antibiotic won't work. There are many effects that pneumonia has on people. There are different effects on children than there are on elderly people. They are overproduction of mucus and other fluids, leading to difficulty breathing and inhabiting gas exchange in the lungs, making it harder to supply the body with oxygen. In the long term, pneumonia can be associated with permanent lung damage, putting people at risk of respiratory failure in the future because their lungs are no longer as strong and healthy as they once were. Treating pneumonia early can help limit permanent lung problems. The effects of pneumonia on the lungs can lead people to have shortness of breath, a bluish tinge in the extremities, and rapid breathing as they fight for air. Patients may also cough, often producing sputum. In some cases, pneumonia leads to the development of abscess in the lungs, a potentially serious complication. Patients can also go into respiratory failure, where the lungs are no longer able to function and mechanically ventilation may be required to keep the person alive. Bacteria and viruses are the prime cause of pneumonia when a person breathes pneumonia, causes germs into his lungs or, and his body in the system can't otherwise revert entry. The organisms settle in small air sacs called alveoli. alveoli and continue multiplying as the body sends white blood cells to attack the infection, the sacs become filled with fluid and pus, causing pneumonia. Pneumonia has bacterial, viral, fungal and other primary causes. <laughs> oh, wait, Cody, I forgot my line. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on, what is it? Okay. There are many effects that pneumonia have, have on people. There are different effects on children than there are on elderly people. There are overproduction of mucus and other fluids, leading to difficulty 